Hey guys, I want to show you the bags that I got at Marshall's yesterday. I think these are both really great finds. I have a road trip coming up at the end of June. I'll be on the road for two weeks and I'm always looking for ways to save money and make my life easier. So I thought both of these bags would help me do that. So this first bag is a polar pack. It's basically a collapsible soft cooler. And this was in the men's section. They had this in black with purple trim and I got the red with like a gray trim. I just thought it was a nicer color. I don't really like black coolers because especially if you take it to the beach, I feel like the black would absorb all the heat. So I thought red was lighter color than the black and maybe it won't absorb as much heat. So this cost $9.99 and I think it was a good deal. So there's um, a Velcroed pocket on the front um, that expands a little bit and this is great if you want to put like knives, forks, spoons, napkins, um, wet ones, that kind of stuff. Um, it has a handle and it also, it actually, it has, it has two carrying handles if you want to use the carrying handles, but it also has a shoulder strap. And I thought that's always a convenient feature because I'm always carrying a gazillion bags, um, whether I'm traveling or whether I'm going to the beach. It's never just one or two. It's always like four or five things I'm carrying. So shoulder straps always come in handy. Um, the other thing I liked about the top, so it zips all around the edges and it has this flip top. So you don't have to open the entire thing. Like if you're traveling, if you're in your car, you just want to get a can of soda or a bottle of water, you open the top, reach in, get what you want and close it up and everything is good. So I like that feature. It's also very roomy. This is a 40 can cooler. So it definitely will hold a lot of food and drinks. I have one a little bit larger than this uh, on wheels um, with, it's actually a hard sided cooler. And it's just been, the past few times I've used it on road trips, it's been a little bit too bulky. I like the fact that it's on wheels and it has like, you know, the handle that pops up um, so you could wheel it around. But I just thought it was too big and bulky. So I'm going to try this one this year and see how it goes. And here's what the bag looks like totally collapsed. Um, it has these Velcro enclosures. Um, so you, you, uh, Un unzip these when you want to use the bag and when you want to fold the bag up just tighten up the velcro and it makes a much more compact bag to either travel with or to store so for $9.99 I thought it had a lot of great features and uh, it was a good deal and when I was paying for this at the checkout the cashier um, even told me it was a great deal and that they get these in usually once a year when it's seasonal and they go really, really fast. The only reason they hadn't gone yet was because they're in the guys section and they don't get as many guys shopping in that Marshalls. Um, it's mostly women. It's probably 75% women, 25% guys. Um, so she's like, get them while you can. So the other bag that I found in the men's section at Marshalls was this Case Logic backpack. Um, the first thing I noticed was that it's Case Logic, and Case Logic makes technology friendly backpacks. So I knew right away that this would be great for carrying my laptop around with. It probably even has sections for other tech gadgets and tech gear. And it was on clearance. Originally $29.99, I got it for $20. So I thought that was a great deal because normally um, this would go for around $60 if you bought it at a Best Buy or something like that. So here's what the tag says. It's for 15.6 inch laptop plus tablet, which is great. I didn't even read this in the store just because I knew by looking at it that it would fit. So I have a 15 inch uh, MacBook from 2009 that I still use. Um, this says it is great for a 15.6 inch laptop and a 10.1 inch tablet or iPad. My tablet, um, I have the Samsung Galaxy Tab 8.4, so it's smaller than that, so that would fit fine also. Then they just show a few pictures of where you wanna put stuff. Adjustable, removable sternum strap, 
I never really use that, but those are good to have like when you're walking around all day. It just helps uh, helps with the load. Lockable zippers, but lock is not included. Well, I have some uh, luggage locks that I had gotten at uh, TJ Maxx. Um, it looks very spacious. Articulating straps. I really don't know what articulating straps mean, but okay. Strap management system. Hardware not included. Okay. Um, yeah, so let me show you these features. So right now I'm looking at the back of the bag and it has this padded, zippered compartment. This is really heavily padded. So I'm thinking this might be really good for my external hard drive. So I just put in my external hard drive. Here's my hard drive and the wire that it goes with. And it's pretty much a perfect fit for this pocket, which is awesome. I didn't even realize it had that feature. Then if we open the back zippered compartment, we can see that it perfectly fits my old beat up laptop. So this is awesome so far. I have my laptop and I have my hard drive stored safely in the bag. So it has two more zippered sections in the front. Let's open the bigger one. There's a pocket um, that has plenty of room for my tablet. Um, it would even fit my bigger old iPad if I chose to travel with that one. And there's still, you know, inches of space in this compartment, which would be, you know, which is great for toiletries or pajamas or reading materials. And then we have the smaller front compartment. And let's open this one. Now, just to show you how spacious this smaller front compartment is, I put in a pair of sneakers. These are my running shoes or my walking shoes. Um, but it's a full size pair of sneakers that easily fit in this compartment. There they are. So it's full size sneakers, huge compartment. Um, however, if I chose not to put shoes in here, you could see that it has um, a zippered pouch. It has a few more compartments. A few more compartments. I could probably put some chargers and stuff like that. And a zippered pouch, which will probably um, be great for chargers also. Here's what the inside of the compartment looks like with both my laptop charger and my tablet charger. They fit neatly into this pouch and there's still a ton of room. Um, the sneakers still definitely fit in this compartment, which is great for short weekend trips. If you just want to wear a pair of shoes and you're staying overnight somewhere and you just want to bring some sneakers so you could get up and work out in the morning, I'm loving how spacious this bag is. Then on the front, it has this uh, strap loop, which I don't 100% know what it's for, but, you know, if I want to hang something on it, um, you know, just put a carpenter on it, and it's great to hang stuff off of. Then there are also two side pockets. There's one on each side, and they perfectly fit um, bottles of water. This is one of those clean canteens, reusable water canteens, and that fits in there perfectly. And here's the same pocket on the other side. So there's a carry handle on top, which is a great feature, and everything feels really sturdy. This does not feel like a cheap, flimsy bag. So here's the sternum strap. Um, it attaches and it unattaches, it clips and it unclips. And then I noticed it has like these little areas. Um, I don't know what they're for, but you know, Hey, you need to carry a Sharpie? They would fit in there. They'd probably get knocked out also. Um, if anyone knows what these loops are for, uh, please comment below because I'm a little bit too clueless uh, right now. But maybe it's a really cool feature and I'd like to use it. So if you could help me out with that, that would be awesome. And those are the two bags that I bought at Marshall's yesterday. Thank you very much for watching the video. Please subscribe to my channel if you'd like me to post more videos. And visit me on my website at carriehallwell.com. You could also check me out on Instagram, Twitter, 
Facebook, and Pinterest. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. Bye.